I wanted to show a video of how to smooth out micro motors. I did a previous video on how to balance micro props, which is very simple. You get a pencil lead, then you basically shake it, and the motion of shaking is extremely low friction. See how that prop is basically floating on air. But even after balancing the props, I still get quite a bit of vibration, some worse than others. So I'm showing this video on how to balance the actual motors themselves. And you can see on this one I had to take off quite a bit of metal to actually balance it. So basically the setup is you use ceramic razor blades and they're actually not that sharp. and then use some non-hardening putty this is like a silicon type clay and then get yourself a flat surface, a glass plate and then the putty holds your blades they don't have to be exactly straight and you try to eyeball it but they work very well and then you put the little motor on there look for the low spot so I'm already balanced on this one really not much of a low spot and when it acts kind of random you're pretty much done with your balance you can see how bad this motor is can feel it run also so it's pretty obvious where the heavy spot is now I'm using a file the file down the aluminum but the file if it has metal if it has metal uh, scraps in it, it, the magnets are going to get full, so we'll have to clean this with hot water. Spray it, because uh, you'll start gaining weight in the magnets with the shavings from previous filings that were metal. Now if you look close, you see how the magnets are getting full of shavings. Shavings from the file. So we want to clean that out with some hot water just want to this isn't a this isn't enough velocity to clean it out so I use a sprayer now spraying into the motor blows all those filings out and once it's balanced it just becomes kind of random where it wants to stop kind of lose that speed up and slow down Now I always use a magnifying glass. This is a five, number five headset. And putting the C clamp, I'll put it on there and then I'll squeeze it, but I can't hold the camera at the same time. Basically squeeze it right on and then taking the C clamp off. I'll use a needle and pops the C-clamp right out. Here's the last one. It was actually not too bad, but there's the low spot. I'm going to file that down. When your motors are balanced, there's no vibration. You cannot feel any vibration, even at full throttle, 60,000 RPMs. So let's see how these Flywoo motors are. Check them on the setup, get them balanced. Now this one has two different size shafts. So when it rolls, it's gonna roll in a circle. Can't get too many rolls out of it. 
But it does seem to have a heavy spot. Not too bad though. It's actually better than the smaller motors. When they make the motor you can see it's copper plated. Get that nice finish. And when it's balanced it just kind of acts random. The balance is better than the, the rig. Got a good balance on this one. Just moves nice and easy. It doesn't speed up and slow down.